Vernon Dye, Fiery Guy, and this is a general maintenance instructional on the linearization of a Canon image press. The first thing we want to do is make sure that we have an 11 by 17, 28 pound hammer mill assigned to a particular tray. This one we have in tray two. So I'm going to close the tray. I will begin by going into the settings and registration button. And by the way, you do not have to be logged in as administrator to do this function. I will next choose the adjustment maintenance key. Follow that by the adjustment and image quality, and then the auto adjust gradation. And since I'm going to be doing a full adjust, I want to make sure I select the initialize when using a full adjust and toggle that on. Say OK, and then choose full adjust. Well, let me select my tray. By default, it sees the 11 by 17. Simply choose OK and begin printing. So this is our first test pattern sheet. And from the uh, control touch panel, you can see how it shows instructions how to lay it on the glass and how we're going to begin with the scan. So I am going to take this document, lay it on the screen just as the control panel instructs, instructed us. Shut the lid down, begin the start scanning button. Now, while that is scanning in and while we're printing, we will get a second test pattern sheet. What we're trying to do here is look for any imperfections or any effects. There could be some line striations. There could be some white speckles or some off color. I see one particular spot blemish on this one. It's not a big deal, but something that we want to be um, observing, monitoring. If it's something that's looks really bad, we might open a service call to have a service tech look at the machine. Take the next sheet out and move the first sheet. I'm going to place this document just as the screen shows us here onto the black glass. Lower the document feeder and begin starting scanning a second time. Once we re re get, get to the third test pattern sheet, printing and scan it in, we'll hit apply and we'll wait for the machine to go through its iterations and we're set. We complete the linearization. So this is our third and final test pattern. And as you look at the, the black bars for placement, the top of the platen glass, We'll lower the document feeder and select start scanning. Now collectively, we'll have three scans that'll be applied to our new saved settings. And now we're ready to do a full fiery calibration.